Okay, we'll see a little bit about the Envy installation. We assume that you have downloaded the software from the ITT Visual Information Solutions website. You've got it somewhere stored in your computer. You can just double click on the executable file. In Windows 7, you have to give permissions in order to start installing because of the fact that uh, you are not the actual administrator. You have administrable privileges, you might have, but you're not the actual administrator account on your computer most of the times. I'll choose setup. I'll pause a little bit. the recording until the extraction takes place now we have entered the license wizard just click next accept the terms of the license agreement you can choose a directory to install but the default one is ok click next and the options the extra options you have to install appear in this box note here that uh, the envy tools will not appear as an extra option and that's why because uh, there is no ArcGIS installed in this computer I'll just leave the envy program files for installation I'll click next and I'll pause the video during this procedure after the installation completes the first thing you are asked to do is to under your license you won't under a license right now but you have to keep in mind two things that uh, you receive a license file which is uh, a name dot dot or name dot leak and you just enter it in the application if you have a, a floating license you need to configure your license server as well so we won't enter a license now just press no and press finish for the installation to complete as you can see there was no question about the desktop icons they were just installed uh, automatically now if we want to enter a license we go to mv48 tools and we we'll have to start the license wizard once again you have to give it access as an administrator and here is the license wizard application if we don't if we haven't received the license we can request a license by clicking on this radio button request a license and then a text is generated actually with our uh, host ID which is what is uh, important for ITD Visual Solutions to create the license for us install a license you have received if you have already received the license we we'll click on this radio button and then we have to browse in our file system in order to install this license nevertheless I don't have a valid license right now 
but you need to have a dot or dot dot or dot leak license file in order to activate your license if you have a, a license server what you need to do is to configure the variable that is needed in order to your the application envy to look for the license file elsewhere in your network so in the environmental in the environmental variables in the environment variables you need to add this variable see this system variable lm license file the port which is usually 1700 and the server name and that's all and then the program is ready to run